welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is Thursday, September 3rd, and today I am filming a vlog. So it has been nearly a week since I have posted a YouTube video, and that's just been because we have been in Alabama not doing much of anything. But today I am over here in Pensacola, Florida. I am about to go pick up one of my very best friends. Her name is Emily and we are driving about an hour and a half to some springs these springs are like crystal clear blue water and i cannot wait to go visit so i am on the way right now to her house to go pick her up so it should be a really fun day i'm so excited so i am going to bring you along with me today let's do the darn thing y'all all right, we're stopping at Walmart to go get us some goggles so we can see in the springs. Woohoo! All right, y'all, we got the goods. We got goggles, we got a pool noodle, we got uh, Joe Exotic over there. <laughs> and we're ready to go to the springs. Yay! <laughs> we just made it to the Ponce de Leon Springs here in Florida. Let's go check it out, y'all. I'm so excited. All right, y'all. We just got out here to Ponce de Leon Springs and look at how beautiful it is out here. It is absolutely incredible. It is blue, crystal clear water, and there's very few people here, but I've heard it can get really crowded on the weekends. We're here on a Thursday, but there's picnic tables. It is absolutely beautiful, and the cars are just right there. So it's just a little short walk down the boardwalk to this beautiful springs. It's like 60 to 70 degrees in here, so it's going to be really cold, but look at how pretty it is. Time to brave the water. <laughs> Ooh, how cold is it? <laughs> Y'all, it is cold in here. It is really cold, but it's refreshing. I'm telling myself it's refreshing as I freeze to death. <laughs> it is absolutely beautiful though. Right now we're just kind of walking back here through this little stream and it is just crystal clear it is so pretty there's a little fish right there it is beautiful back here it's unreal the springs there's also a boardwalk nature trail it says it's about a 30 minute walk i don't know if we're going to do the whole thing today but we're going to go check it out because guess what it says there could be alligators oh look at this how it is beautiful back here oh my gosh 
Oh, look at this, how pretty it is back here. Not as pretty as this crystal clear water, but still. Going on a walk, going on a walk. Y'all, is this not the coolest thing ever? This is where the spring, the crystal clear spring meets the river. And there's like a clear division of where they come together. Is that not the coolest thing? How neat, it's like the river's on this side, the spring's on this side. How, that is so neat. We swam in the springs, we went on two different nature hikes, and now it is only 12.48, so we decided to go visit another spring. We are at Ponce de Leon here, and we're about to go to Morrison Springs, which is like a nine minute drive away. So, let's do it, should be fun. All right, y'all, we're pulling up to Morrison Springs. It was an eight minute drive from the other springs. And it seems like there's very few people here and you don't have to pay to get in. So let's go check it out. This spring is definitely much bigger. It's like all of this swamp and then it goes straight into the spring and it is beautiful. It's a little bit brown because of the rain, but wow, it is so pretty out here. It's unreal. See, it's all swamp over here. I feel like your chances of getting eaten by a gator are much higher here. It's so pretty. Yeah. Well, we decided to get back in the cold water and do a little bit more swimming here at Morrison Springs. I don't think it's as cold as the other spring, but it's still pretty darn cold. My legs are freezing and I'm scared to get the top half of my body wet. Let's do it. We're swimming out here in the springs. Just keep swimming. <laughs> I've got to say, this is pretty freaking cool. If you ever get the chance to come to these springs, it's a really neat experience. And this one's free to come to. So this is obviously a spring-fed little area, and this is where the spring comes out. It is so <laughs> cold. I see cold right here. Oh my god, my lens is fogging up. It's so cold. <gasps> spring of the day is Vortex Springs. I figured we're on a roll. Why not hit one more before we go back to Pensacola? All right, so this is Vortex Springs and this is definitely a more touristy springs. It's definitely been very built up and they have slides and stuff and rope swings, but it's really pretty. It was $10 a person to get in, so. We're gonna go swim around, check it out. For the third time today, we have to get into this freezing cold water. It's so cold, y'all. You have no idea. It is so cold. I got goosebumps all over my arms. You would think it would be easier for the third time today, and it definitely is not. It takes your breath away. It's so cold. Well, we are leaving our third and final spring of the day. We're here at Vortex Springs, and I've got to say that this was my least favorite of our day. 
this is very much more so a swimming hole that they've made out of a spring. Like whenever I go to a spring, my favorite thing is to just put on my goggles, see the fish, the plants growing, and here it's just more so like a tourist attraction. So if you're like me, don't come here. We're gonna go get us some barbecue because it's three o'clock. We haven't eaten, we are starving. So we have about an hour and a half drive home. We're gonna get food somewhere along the way. So let's get started. We are absolutely starving. So we found this little hole in the wall trailer there behind us called the lunch it box. Has a hole in the wall. <laughs> it does have a hole in the wall. And we're gonna try it out. Not sure if we're risking anything. We're doing it. And I don't think I'm gonna put on pants because we're outside at the lunch box. Let's do it. I have a feeling it has 4.5 stars on Google. $20 should be enough for lunch. Oh yeah, I think $20 is enough. Let's do this. All right, let's see what we're gonna order. All right, guys, so I know this isn't totally keto because I am going to eat the bun, but your girl is hungry. This is what is called the buffalo kicking chicken. It's got grilled chicken, buffalo wing sauce, ranch, crumbled bacon, and Swiss cheese. Ooh, this is going to be so good after a day of swimming and Diet Coke because I drank a bunch of water already. Yum. Well, we just made it to Emily's barn after a day of swimming in the springs. It's time to go do some farm work and take care of the horses and donkeys and pigs and everyone else who has to eat here. So time to go feed all the animals. Let's do it. We just got out to the barn and it is time to feed all of the animals. There's horses over here horses and donkeys over here and about to head into the barn. Hey Rony Pony, how you doing bud? You so pretty, you so pretty. You make me really want a horse again. Mm-hmm. I think I'm gonna start riding lessons when I get back home. Y'all, I miss riding horses so much. If you didn't know, I actually used to own horses in high school. I raised livestock. So coming and being around animals is literally the best thing to me. I miss it so much. There's just a couple barn kitties here. Just a couple, not many at all. <laughs> there is so many barn cats. Holy moly, look at all of them eating their dinner. Hey Laylee, how's it going sweet girl? Hey. You've got the cutest little nose, don't ya? Don't ya? Yeah. And we got Philly over here who's very jealous I'm giving pets to other horses and not her. Although she's gonna pin her ears because I don't have a treat for her, so she's not gonna be happy. She's like, I just don't want you to touch me right now. I just wanna go outside and eat my grass. You're so pretty, Philly. Me? and Roni. We're heading out to the pasture right now. Here comes the little donkey gang over here. Mm. Hey, oh, okay, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. Donkeys everywhere. Somebody love me. Do you want to love me? Oh, hello. Donkeys. Get on. Get on the donkey donk. Get on that one. This one? Y'all look at this praying mantis. I touched his stick and he's not very happy with me. But isn't he cool looking? This is Rowdy. He's just a little pig. Just a little tiny pig, you know? And he only eats cooked food. He doesn't like pig food. You have to cook for him every day. He's just only a little bit spoiled. And he's the cutest thing ever. It looks like we're teaching a little kitty kindergarten class right now. All the kittens are just sitting here looking at us. 
Oh, and there's one right there eating my boot. And you're so cute. Oh, you're so cute too. Little kitties everywhere. Well, y'all, it is currently 825. It has been quite the day. We have done so much, had so much fun, but your girl is exhausted. I am staying here in Pensacola tonight with my grandmother one more night because Mobile is another hour and a half away and I just cannot drive that tonight. So I just picked me and my grandmother up a couple of things from Tropical Smoothie Cafe, some wraps, a salad. I just got a little smorgasbord so we have something to eat for dinner tonight. So that's what we're working with. About to head inside and eat and then probably pass out. So I think I'm going to go ahead and close out this video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's visit to the Springs. It was such a fun day. I enjoyed it. If you ever get the chance, be sure to go check out those Springs. They are amazing. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't done so. And I will see y'all again real soon with another video. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.